hand is so cold right now. She thrives on fear. Go over there. Oh my fuck. <laughs> apartment video today and I am solo Joey my brother is assisting me um, he won't be on camera James had an unfortunate incident he blew his tire on his car so he can't be in this video today so what we have here we have some new equipment that we've been teasing you guys about we've got the REM pod and we've got the music box so we're going to set these up in the hot spots in the house, and we're going to do a little investigation. That's how it goes off. If you've never seen a rim pod before, if something comes near it or touches it, it'll go off. We're going to be on that side of the table, so we're not going to be anywhere near this. And then we've got the music box. That's what you like here, if something touches it. Alright, so we've got a cat ball here. The REM pod here, spirit talker, and that is connected to the speaker, the music box. Are you messing with my speaker again? Alright, something's already messing with the speaker, that's fun. So, as you can see, me being here is not affecting this. You have to be at a closer kind of distance. Um, so I should not set that off at all. If anybody's here, it's just me tonight. James isn't here. We've got some new equipment for you. We've got a music box that you can step in front of and it, the music plays. We've got this REM pod here that just tells me if you're touching it. And of course we have the EMF reader that you like to spike. And we also have the spirit talker here that I'm communicating with you through. And then we've got the cat balls that we always have. Like I said before, you just tap them to touch and they should light up. You should stay. Oh. Well, we live here, so of course we're gonna stay. Is that you setting off the EMF? Blacksmith. Were you a blacksmith? You can set that off all the way to the red. That would be great. Are you still here? How about we do a little yes and no? If you don't want to talk, you can set something off for yes and back away for no. Maybe the music box or the REM pod or even the EMF over here. You can set that off for yes as well. Spike it all the way to the red. You notice how evasive they've been in the house lately? Yeah. Like they don't really want to interact with us anymore after, with us anymore after, with us anymore after, with us anymore after the investigation that Colin and Connor did. Like I feel like it's been like weird. It's like weird. Like it I'm happy. So maybe they're just trying to tell us they're happy where they're at right now. It could be the nurse that likes to talk to me sometimes. Is Mary here, the nurse? Did you do your rounds tonight at the hospital? Where are you? Are you in the living room or the bathroom? You've been very quiet lately. We just want to talk to you. We're not going to hurt you. Jeffrey. Is that what your name is? Are you standing next to me? Dude, that spiked all the way to the red. Jeffrey, if you um, have enough energy, do you want to set off one of our equipment? Murder. Were you killed? If you like music, we have a music box over here. All you have to do is stand in front of it. Violet. Violet, do you want to talk to us? That's 
I'm like, always a second late. Violet, can you spike that all the way to the red if that was you? We would really appreciate it. Or Jeffrey? It's like they come and go so quickly. It's always... I'm in my 40s. Just to clarify, there are two Marys. Mary Lou Arruda and Mary the Nurse. Now, if I feel like I'm talking to Mary Lou, I'll say Mary Lou. But if I feel like I'm talking to the nurse that contacted me, I'll just say Mary. We have so much equipment for you here. You're so quiet. Take a seat. Are you still standing next to me? Is that you setting that off? Why don't you pull some energy and set off one of our bigger pieces of equipment? I'm gonna set it there. Him. Him? Is that Jeffrey? Do you maybe want me to move the equipment somewhere away from us? Are you are you nervous or scared? We won't hurt you. We just want to talk. I wander these grounds. I know you've told us that before. Did you die here? Or maybe at the hospital? If I get anything correct, can you spike this to red? Or set something off? There. There what? What's theirs? Judas Cradle. Judas Cradle? What is that? I have no idea. What does that mean? I said if you need more energy, you can drain something. Use the energy from that. Judas Cradle derives its name from the biblical figure of Judas Iscariot who betrayed Jesus Christ. It was believed that the torture device was named after Judas. So he was like, kind of like a devil. Could be. A person who was religious died. But that's like... Wrong. <laughs> what the fuck? I just got <laughs> chills in my back. Dude, it literally told me I was wrong. Can you come stand next to me and set one of these off? Oh my fuck. <laughs> my ashes are here. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Yo, what the fuck? <laughs> not one of us touched it. Look, I'm not Bro, saying it off. Bro, my hairs are standing up so late. You like. have to be this close to it. Like, you have to be... See, it stops here. Bro. Eric. Eric. We've gotten that name before. Eric, is that you setting off the equipment? You're doing a great job. If I go next to the music box, will you set it off? It's very pin... Oh my god. Oh my god. Thank you so much. Wait till Bob. He scares me. Who scares you? Well, you can stay with us if you're scared. You don't have to be around whoever scares you or whatever scares you. Can you come stand next to me and set this off? Or if you like that small one, you can set it off again if you want to do that one. What the fuck? That's great. Can you make your way over here? Hate. Hate. You don't like the music box? Can you come stand next to me? Go over there. You want me to go where the rum pot is? Can you set something off to confirm? Rosemary. Rosemary. Dude, I just got a spike over here and then that. Are you walking back and forth? Can you come over here? You really like the REM pod, but I need you to try to do something else. Just so I know that you're actually here. Were you just standing right here? Can you tell me how many people are here? We're here. <laughs> Can you tell me how many people are here? It says we're here. Can you tell me where you are? It's weird. 
It's like they want to talk to us, but they feel like they can't. Or like, they're passing through so quickly that, like, we get vague, like, interactions, and then it's another person that comes through. Is this place a portal? Is the parking lot to Morton? Do you guys pass through there? We are making contact. Is this where you guys pass on? Suffered. A lot of people have died here and have suffered. Can you play music? We have a music box right there. If you stand in front of it, it'll play music for you. Can you stand in front of the music box and play music? She thrives on fear. Can you set off our equipment again? You were doing so well. Can you maybe touch one of these cat balls? There's one over there. There's one over there. And there's three on this table. Is someone still here with us? Did you want to tell us your story? There's a lot of suffering. Maybe from the hospital behind us. So for any new viewers, our backyard is literally a hospital. It's like a couple houses down. Our street connects to the parking lot. Many other souls. Which is to be expected. A lot of you must pass through when you, when you pass away. Does anybody have a message to send out? It's actually really sad if you think about that. Huh? Like many other souls and it's like people constantly die at the hospital. Because they don't have the right... I don't know. The hospital's just not great. I could turn on my speaker again and you can take some energy from that. You seem to like doing that a lot. That is going nuts. And there's nothing electronic over there. And it stopped. Do you that? Right? Relation. Are you related to us? Or are you connected to us in some way? What relation is there? Are you a family member? Fight. I just seen a. I just seen a. I just seen a. I just seen a. I just seen a, just seen a blue orb on the screen. Blue orb. I did bad things. And the EMF detector. Holy fuck. And that's not me. You have to be super close to that. I have the chills. You moving all around me? Should we move out into the... It's going fucking nuts. That went nuts at the same time. Are you standing over here? Maybe it's because the EMF detector's next to it. Oh, look. Oh. Settlement. My name is Peter. Peter, is that you setting this up? Hand <laughs> is so cold right now. Are you holding my hand? Are you standing right here? Like, there's a, a temperature difference between my hands right now. Like, I feel like I just stuck my hand in the fridge. I feel like I stuck my hand in the fridge. 
Don't provoke us. Gaining more energy. Well, if that's the case, set off the music box before we end the session. If you have energy and you have something to tell us, you know, tell us, you know, tell us, you know, tell us. Trust the man. Me. Me. They're talking about me. Trust me. See? See? Thank you. Thank you, sir. Or ma ma'am. Telling you to listen to me. Is this still Peter? It's not cold over here anymore. Look, my hand went back to normal temperature. Richard. Richard, it's nice to talk to you again. I hope you're doing okay. You were very friendly the last time we talked. Oh my god, something just touched my fucking neck. Could have been your hoodie. No, no, my hoodie's all the way down here, bro. It felt like somebody went... You said you're getting energy to communicate with us. Can you set off all the colors? Is it no? <laughs> Many family memories. Is this a family member? Me and Tony were talking about, like, I was telling him about how Puppy used to play soccer with me every day before work. If this is a family member, can you set that off again? Do we know you? So we had a quick intermission because my memory card filled up. I am notorious for not emptying it. Um, so while we were, in, we were in, let me reset it because this is a new session. When we were in our little intermission, we got the, the name Regina and I've gotten her before off camera. She also worked at the hospital like Mary did. Um, I think she was also a nurse there if I remember correctly. Um, did you want to ask? Papa, are you here? We suspect that a family member is here because not once but twice we got hints of it. We got relations and we got family memories. And yesterday my brother had said that he was speaking to his friend about some family memories about a specific person in our family that had passed away. Of course. It's Papa. Holy shit. You've been setting off this equipment on us? Maybe that was him messing with you when you felt the hand. Maybe. Are you still here? I'm intrigued. He's intrigued. It's cold right here again. But like, not right here. And not back here. Just right here. Yo, I have goosebumps. Our remains. Are you with Steve? We have Uncle Steve's ashes. My ashes remain here. You remember I said that earlier? I have Uncle Steve's ashes in my room. We all do. If you're still here, can you set off our equipment? If you can stay, we want to talk to you. It's not cold here anymore. Impose. What you're not that? imposing. What does that mean? means like we don't like if somebody like invites you to dinner we don't want to impose like we don't want to like make it like you know extra work or anything are you still here i put the music box over here because i know you've been touching the rem pod so if you walk by can you touch the REM pod? My name is Ethel. Ethel, can you set off our equipment? Andrea. Okay, Andrea, can you set off our equipment? You can take energy from anything you need. We just want to know that you're actually here. If you're new here, you can set this equipment off. You can touch it's this. It's scary thing. here. You don't have to be scared. Or you can walk in front of that and set that off. They won't hurt you. We won't either. This is a safe space. Not friendly. We just want to talk. Let's sit and talk. 
I said, we just want to talk. Let's sit and talk. Amanda. Does anybody want to set anything off before we end this? And we say goodbye? Alright, so, as you can see, we got some evidence today. They were a little quiet. Um, I think they like messing with James and he's not here tonight, so... Rempod went absolutely nuts. I'm reaching out. Um, well, you can set the REM pod off while I'm doing the outro. Yeah, this is our first test with the equipment. Obviously, the spirits here don't like the music box. It might not be from their time period, so they might not really appreciate it. Um, but they seem to like the REM pod. And that's a good thing, because that was what I was most excited for. That was, like, the one thing that I wanted for our investigations for the channel. James will be back. Yeah, you're going to start seeing this equipment a lot more, and we are so excited to expand when we're investigating. So, in the meantime, stay wicked and stay twisted. Ah.